Here are the Walmart dupes brands don't want you to know about. Miralax, Clearlax. <laughs> Walmart said nobody cares that they were that close. This is to keep you regular. The brand name one cost me $8.67. The Walmart dupe cost me $4.88. That is saving me $3.79. The bottles, exactly the same. 4.1 ounces of product in each. It says you can pour into any drink and it's not gonna change the flavor. I know some people do this in the morning with their coffee. They just throw a little bit in. I also wanna see if it's like gonna completely dissolve. That's what I was saying, is it fiber? Because fiber will chunk up on you and then you're having oatmeal. And then you gotta go fast or you're gonna choke. And then they're gonna have to call the paramedics and they're gonna be like, what happened? Uh, her fiber <laughs> stuck in her throat. Cut it. I'm very dramatic. My mind goes to worst case scenario. If they're the same, you don't think I'm gonna save almost four bucks? Especially if you have to use it every day. Unflavored powder, grit free. Smell the brand name one first. I smell a chemical. It might be my nose, you guys know. My nose and my imagination run their own lives. I'm not in control there. I don't know what it is. Disinfectant, I don't know. Pour a little bit out. Clear Lags is such a great name, isn't it? They should win an award for that. <gasps> if you told me that these were made at different factories, I would call you a liar to your face. These are made at the same place. In my non-professional opinion, I don't know nothing about this. Easy peasy to use. You just sprinkle a little bit into your drink. I'm gonna do this little baby teaspoon into each one. Don't get chunky on me now. Dissolved very nicely. It only took a few seconds, so that's very impressive. Subscribe to this girl right here because she's the only one doing it like this. And if anybody copies her they're the dupe brand name first I can do this delicious I feel none of it it's gone it tastes like nothing very impressed the Walmart dupe save yourselves the four dollars no difference the exact same amount of active ingredient in both it's really good I'm super impressed with it so save yourself the money I'm gonna give the brand name one or Vivian heads clear lax wins all kinds of awards I'm gonna give the clear lax five <laughs> I just want to keep saying clear lax it makes me happy when I say it five Vivian Heads. American Crew Fiber High Hold Low Shine. But I know it's for the boys. It could be for anybody, but it's targeted towards the boys. I'm sure that it will work on any hair. And the price difference on this one is outrageous. Brand name one is gonna cost you $17.84 for that little guy. Walmart's dupe, $7.54. Somebody call American Crew and let's find out what's going on over there. They act like we're at a high-end salon. Excuse me, we're at Walmart. I thought I was like in a high-end JCPenney's salon. Do y'all miss going to the mall? Do y'all miss Sears? <laughs> I miss Sears, I miss Kmart. By buying the Walmart one over the brand name one, you're gonna save $10.30. They're the same amount too. The Walmart one is giving you 3.8 ounces. Oh, wait a second, what's going on here? This isn't exposed because a lot of the products that I have here on my table, it's more than 50% markup, a lot of them. The brand name one is giving us three ounces of product. Walmart is giving us 3.8. Okay, butter, Walmart's giving us even the same little swirl. Tell me, which one's which? You can't tell. It might be a perfect dupe. The name brand first. Look at that. Mantequilla. That's what that is. Spanish word of the day. The so what? Listen, if you're buying this for your husband or your teenage son, if they can tell a difference, I would be shocked. The consistency is the same. The smell is the same. <laughs> I want to warm it up with my finger. Brand name one rubbed in really nice. Walmart dupe. Now let's try it on her hair. She's been in a bag. I'm just going to scoop it from here. That much. I think you have to like... That's looking cute. Look at her curls on this side. I'm gonna buy the Walmart dude. I wanna save 50%. Oh, look at that. It's working the same. Look how cute her hair looks. She's a little wonky. I just styled that in like five minutes. I'm a beautician now. Come over, I'm gonna dye your hair blonde. Don't trust me with some bleach. I think they're made on the same product line. I mean, I don't know. That's what it seems like. Our new rule is we're not fighting for the brand. We're fighting for our coins. So for all of those reasons, I'm gonna give the brand name one four Vivian heads and I'm gonna give the Walmart dupe five Vivian heads. Olay Total Effects seven and one. Walmart's dupe. This is crazy. Brand name one costs me. $23.48. Walmart knocked it off with the seven in one, not six in one or four in one. No, they got all seven things in here. $9.82. That is saving us $13.66. Olay, we got your 800 number. Can we call and ask questions? I don't understand how Walmart and these companies that are kind of like making copies are doing things like this. I've done a million of these videos and it's still shocking to see such a huge price difference. So listen, 
again, if you can't afford a $24 face cream, go pick you up this one. It's comparable. People get crazy with the ingredients. It drives me insane. But don't in my comments leave me comments about ingredients when you're smoking right now. <laughs> No judgment, I'm just saying. I don't even know what the seven things are, but I want it. We all want the seven things. Replenishes, brightens, evens the look of skin tone, minimizes the look of pores, visibly firms, visibly smooths. Brand name one has SPF in it. Keep the sunscreen. I got a separate one in the bathroom. Here's the Walmart one. Listen, we need an investigator to go undercover at these factories and tell us the truth. Same amount of product. Brand name one on this hand. That's an oh. I think this seven in one Olay has been around for quite some time time so it's tested and true. Those that love it, love it. That feels really nice. It has that traditional Olay smell to it. Remember grandma had that tub of Olay? Oh my grandma loved that stuff. Okay. Oh, I see where the budget went here. The Walmart one is a little bit more watery. The brand name one. That feels really nice. Absorbed beautifully. Now this one. This one, grandma's Olay. This one, perfumey. Rub this one in. Very different. At least how they feel. This one has less ingredients in it. I still like the way the Olay feels. They're different. Smell, texture, absorb, all the things are different. The one from Walmart comes out very violent. It's very aggressive. There's no contest here. The Olay one is really buttery. I know when things first come out, you know, the hype of it all and let's maximize profits. I get it. But you've been around for a minute. We can already lower the price of this one. You can see it right there. Not the same. If you do splurge and go with this one, I think you're still getting a great product. So for all of those reasons, I'm going to give the Olay four Vivian heads and I'm going to give the Walmart one four Vivian heads. Neutrogena oil-free acne wash and the Walmart dupe. Brand name one will cost you $8.34. The Walmart dupe, $3.12. That's a savings of $5.25. Give me my cash. This product I can stand behind. This one. I love this product. If you have problems with acne, oil, clogged pores, any kind of skin problems, and it smells like grapefruit. I like to use this in the morning because it kind of just gives me a, like a refreshed feel to wake me up. Love it. Highly recommended. But if I can save $5 and a quarter, you best believe I will turn my back on them. No kind of loyalty. Listen, the loyalty is to my coins. The same natural pink grapefruit extract, paraben free. Both have the salicylic acid 2%, which is the active ingredient. Both of them are giving us the same amount, 4.2 fluid ounces. So is the product good? I can say yes. I've used it for many, 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 many years. Do I want to save the money? 100%. Immediately, yes. And here's a little pro tip. This stuff is good for people that have like back knee breakouts on their shoulders or their back. They sell this stuff in like body wash size. That's how much I like it. I'm recommending you to buy the body wash from the name brand until they dupe it. Why not just use this? Is it not the same? I'm not a dermatologist or a dentist. So I can't tell you. <laughs> Oh, but that pink grapefruit does it for me every time. And it has little beads in it. Not harsh beads, but it has cute little beads in it. Walmart. Hmm. A little different, but nothing crazy. There's a little difference in the color and maybe the beads. Neutrogena one is very clear. This one has a bit of a foggy look to the gel. Let me see if there's a difference on the thickness or anything like that or the little gel. Yeah. I can feel the little beads in there. It feels really nice. Let me grab the Walmart. Oh, the little beads feel so good, but they're not harsh on your skin. Unless you have like super delicate skin. I don't. I like things to rub me good, scrape the layers off. <laughs> like I like an exfoliation. I'm not a delicate flower. Look how nice that is. See, I can smell it now. It smells very similar to the brand name one. I'm only knocking it for price. I'm not knocking it for anything else. There is the Neutrogena. Now I'm back to the smell again because that's like I just cut through a damn grapefruit. That's how intense that smell flavor scent is. This one is not as intense. Soapy. Nice. Because again, it's one of those products that's been around for a long time. Y'all could have reduced prices by now. Don't play with that inflation thing. Everybody's taking advantage of that. We're going to raise it by 47% because of inflation. Some of y'all took that too far. It's time to start going the other way. So for all of those reasons, I'm going to give the Neutrogena for Vivian Heads and I will give the Walmart Dupe for Vivian Heads. Water Pick, the brand name one, the Walmart Dupe, which they're calling Hydro Clean. The original water pick, this is my own personal one that I have used for years and years, cost me $49.98. Do 
you know, I kicked myself all the way out the door when I was checking out with this guy because this guy at Walmart only cost me $19.98. That's a $30 savings. $50, $20. The pain about using a water pick is that if the water holding thing compartment is small, you have to keep stopping to refill. That's the biggest pain in the butt. But if you want to stay squeaky clean, this is what I use. You're getting every little crevice with that. Now I need to see if the Walmart one is worth the money because if it is, you have no excuses now. For 20 bucks, this thing will last you for years. I think the one I had before this one, I had it for like 10 years. And now I have this one. This one will last me for another 10 to 15 years. Oh, and Walmart gave me batteries. This one's white. It's not sexy and black like that. Oh, it's not sexy and black like that one. Oh, it's white and blue. Oh, that's cute. Is it smaller? It's a little bit smaller. Mine will hold more than seven ounces of water. The one from Walmart does not say how much it will hold. I'll refill it myself for $30. It comes with batteries. It comes with your water pick and it comes with two little attachments for it. One of the attachment is for low pressure. One of them is high pressure. It has a 360 head, quick release for easy tip changing. This little button on top is quick release. Same as this one. Push button on and off switch right there on and off. Removable tank for refill. I just fill it through the little opening. I've never taken the little tank thing off. Isn't that going to make more mess? They both have the same little technology for filling it through the little door. That works for me. 30 seconds of water capacity. 30 seconds. See, they gave us in seconds. They didn't give us an ounce. <laughs> it's a simpler product than this product, but it's still not worth not buying it because you're saving $30. Like that's a huge savings. How many of these could we buy for the price of one of these? My water pick came with three little attachments. One is like a little brush, which is super cool. It's easy to install like that and then release. The Walmart one has just a simple little, just snap it in. Easy peasy. Listen, it's a simple product with a fair price. Here's another Another little disadvantage. Mine is rechargeable. This one is battery powered. If your battery starts dying fast and then you don't use it, that defeats the purpose. If you run out of water and you don't feel like refilling it because it's a pain in the butt, that's going to defeat the purpose. So you got to consider all these things because if you're not going to use it, then who cares if you save 30 bucks? Let's just be honest with ourselves. Water in each of the tanks. This one, as I was putting water in, I'm like, that's not it gonna be annoying to have to refill that over and over as I'm trying to get all my teeth done. Here's the contest. I have two tiny scent beads in here. I'm gonna see which one will dissolve the scent bead faster. Also, okay, there's quite a few differences. This one, every time I look at it, I'm like, yeah, there's a lot of differences. This has an on and off. This has an on and off, but this one has a high and low. My last thing before I turn these on, they're loud. This might be a total fail. <laughs> You see that mess? That's what happens. I, I can see why some people don't want to use a machine like this. Some people do this in the shower because you're literally bathing yourself. It's very intense. I mean, you see there's water all over the place and this is on low. If you hit the gums with this, ouch. Forget the beads, they flew off somewhere. That was not gonna work. Oh wait. Do this over your sink, not out in the open like this. Otherwise water is gonna go everywhere. It is messy as you guys can see. If it's not contained like in your mouth as you're doing it, it's gonna make a huge mess. If you wanna spend a little bit more, highly recommend this one, my absolute favorite. So for all of those reasons, I'm gonna give my water pick four and I will give the Walmart dupe three Vivian heads. If you wanna continue watching videos like this one, I recommend you watch this one next.